Hello everyone, welcome to Physique and uh, we are continuing with the accelerating uh, movement and uh, it is like uh, it is like a curve it is a T V and we have a sum and we have two point here and this part is delta V and delta T and uh, this one is uh, AM and uh, in that place it is a in a point p on the curve and uh, a m equals to delta v delta t and uh, and uh, we uh, knows that uh, uh, a equals to V divided by T and uh, S equals to uh, half V T then S equals to half A T 2 and if we have a, a start point then v equals to v naught plus a t and s equals to v zero plus v uh, divided by two t and uh, which is v zero t plus half a t two As uh, we see, A equals to dv dt v prime, and S equals to A equals to V equals to. V equals to ds dt s prime and uh, a equals to lemus delta v delta t delta t to zero and v equals to lemus delta s delta t delta t to zero okay we're going to have a few examples the first example is a car and the car has a velocity is going up to 80 kilometer each hour delta v equals to 80 kilometers per hour which is 80 multiplied by 1000 divided by 2600 it is uh, 22 meter Per, uh, per uh, second and the t is 9.5 minutes the car's uh, velocity is go up to 80 during 9.5 seconds and then uh, it breaks 
it breaks delta T2 in 3 seconds. Well, what is the um, average? What is the average uh, velocity and uh, acceleration? The first delta A M1 equals to uh, 22 divided by 9.5. It is uh, 2.3 meters second squared, and delta A M2 is uh, uh, from minus 22, and it is uh, in 3. It is minus 7.3 meter second uh, each second. Another example is a aeroplane. Uh, at the at the start, T zero, T one zero, it is a three point five meter second, and uh, and when it's in takeoff. The velocity is 50 meter each second, and uh, how long did S? How much S is it? How long it has the uh, uh, drive before lift up, take off, and uh, And what is the T2? So we know that uh, V equals to AT, then T equals to V divided by A. It is 50 divided by 3.5 is 14 second, uh, 14.3 second. And S is VT half, it is uh, 50, 14, 3 divided by 2, and it is 358 meter. It has the, uh, uh, it has a round, a uh, And, uh, Now we are going to help with the we have now another V V zero plus A T S is V zero T plus half A T two uh, and S equals to V zero plus V half T. An example for this is uh, with, uh, which uh, speed a stone must be uh, cast. Uh, up uh, from a uh, H zero equals to twelve point five meter. to reach the mark in t equals to one second and what is the uh, velocity uh, when it uh, uh, reaches the mark the ground
we are telling the, that A equals to G uh, is 9.82 and uh, Venol, we must find the Venol equals to S minus half A T2 divided by T which is uh, 12.5 minus half 982 T2 divided by and T is a uh, 1 T is 1 divided by 1 it is uh, 7.6 meter second then we we uh, drop uh, not drop uh, we cast up uh, the stone with this uh, velocity and v is uh, v0 plus gt it is uh, uh, 7.6 9.82 multiplied by 1 is 17. Four meter each second. Okay. We have another example. We have a diagram. V and T We are going up to a uh, fourteen and continue here, and they're coming down. It is thirty. It is ten, and this is And this is the twenty-four. Okay, we are looking after the uh, acceleration, retardation, and S. Uh, due to diagram, we have uh, T between here is eight. Here is eight is between 0 till 8 and uh, v v is 0 to 14 then a equals to 14 divided by 8 is 7 half Eight seven four and uh, here is twenty five and T between uh, twenty five to thirty V is uh, between fourteen and zero then A equals to minus 14 divided by 5.
30 minus 25 is 5. And for S, in this, S equals to 100 T equals to 7 micro by 8, 56 meter. And here, S is the 14 multiplied by 5 divided by 2 and s 1 2 and total s is s1 plus s2 it is uh, 35 56 plus 35 is 91 okay it was all in this See you in next.